And now, O Israel, give heed to the statutes and the ordinances which I teach you, and do them, that you may live, and go in and take possession of the land which the Lord, the God of your fathers, gives you. What a promise. Israel is finally about to go in and take over the promised land. But the next words that God gives here in Deuteronomy chapter 4, here in verse 2, are extremely important. It's something that Israel would fight with their whole lives, and it's something I think you and I also struggle with in our spiritual walk. God says, you shall not add to the word which I command you, nor take from it that you may keep the commandments of the Lord your God which I command you. See, first thing God says is, don't add to my commandments. The first temptation we have that God warns us against is adding extra requirements that he has not asked in our religious walk. You see, it's a temptation because we, we come to God and we want to please him and we want to walk with him and we want to enter the promised land. And so we start adding to his requirements, making the Christian life much more difficult than it needs to be. On the other side, it also is a real temptation to take away from the words of God. And God says, you know what? I've given you just the right directions. I've given you instructions of how to live in community with each other, of how to live in relationship with myself, of how to live an abundant life filled with joy, peace, and love. So let's do that together, God says, today.